All right, today we're giving you the lowdown on a PYT. I know for some of you out there, the first thing that comes to mind is Pretty Young Thing from the legendary Michael Jackson, and you would not be wrong. But today, we're gonna take a look at the PYT group break. In this case, what it stands for is pick your team. When a group break is a PYT, everyone participating simply picks the team or teams that they want. Sometimes this is driven by a personal collection, sometimes it's driven by the teams most likely to produce the biggest hits, or sometimes it's just the teams that are still available. Now there's a small catch. In many cases, the teams in a PYT are not all the same price, and there can be a wide range in prices, with the most valuable ones being the teams most likely to render a big card usually because they have really good or star players. So, if you want the good teams, you're likely gonna pay more. Naturally, the number of teams available corresponds to the total number of teams in the league. And in many cases, you'll find people buy more than one team. Once everyone has picked their team, the break begins. And the next part is simple. And you've probably already figured it out. You get the cards that correspond to the teams that you have picked. One special note is that in many breaks, you won't get sent the base cards for your teams, just the more valuable ones. And that is your 101 on a PYT.